So hello YouTube, my name is Vlad and this will be a quick video. I got a couple of questions, well actually get a lot of them. Uh, and the problem is usually that uh, the hash rate is lower than it should be. For example, it's 24 when it should be 29 and 5 mega hashes is a lot of different. So I kind of, I'm making this video in order to, to show you what to do to get the best results. Now there are a couple of tools you need to download before we start. The links will be in the description down below. First one is a display driver uninstaller, which is uh, available for download uh, from this link. This is direct link from my web page. Or you can actually Google and go to Guru 3D. They probably even have a newer version. The next thing you need to do is download blockchain drivers from AMD, but you need to download the first blockchain drivers that were ever made. I'm not quite sure why. Well, at least for me, these drivers seem to work best. Uh, for example, I tried with the latest drivers and uh, I only got 25 uh, mega hashes. And unlike the uh, the first drivers, which I get 29, 29 point something. So again, and the last thing you need to do is to download driver patching utility. This is also a direct link from my web page. I'm not quite sure who made the utility since, well, n there is no about. And uh, this version seems to work with every driver so far. So there is no need to, to search for uh, the latest version. Okay, first of all, I'll be downloading uh, the uh, display driver uninstaller and uh, basically you just enter this link, open file and what you need to do is extract these two files on your desktop or wherever and again this is a self extractor which will extract some more files and uh, basically right click run as administrator yes and uh, this uh, computer is actually windows 7 my miners have windows 10 but it's irrelevant for this um, demonstration what you should do is click on clean and restart and after you do that you will be prompted to reboot then after you reboot you need to well install the drivers that you have downloaded and this is the uh, link, this, this is the uh, softpedia link, just let me show you, copy, paste and here at the bottom you have a download button, what you should do is click, click on softpedia secure and basically that is it, your download should commence, well almost instantly and there you have it, now I already did download those drivers and uh, I will be starting the uh, setup. yes and you should click on accept and install and uh, here you can see that uh, they are uh, checking for the uh, newest version of uh, blockchain drivers and uh, you actually do not need so what you should do is click on this one 17.30 now you can actually see that uh, inside here inside packages then drivers then uh, wind no sorry uh, display and in here you can actually see there is this inf file which actually says which is the aversion. So if you're not sure, you can always check inside the inf file to see uh, which version of drivers you need to install. Anyway, what you should do is click here, click on custom install. And basically, I, I'm, I'm not even quite sure that you need this application, but well, whatever. But you, you need this display driver and you don't need the problem report wizard. You can choose either clean install or install, it's irrelevant at this point because you have used display driver uninstaller and uh, it cleaned everything, so whatever. And you should click on install. Now I won't be clicking because, well, I uh, already have uh, drivers installed and this is my uh, computer that I do some gaming and whatnot, so uh, I do not need blockchain drivers. Anyway, after you click install, what you should do is wait until the process finishes and what you should do click then is you'll get two options. One will be restart and the other one will be skip. And what you should do then is click skip because you don't want to restart because you already have a display uh, drivers which has modified BIOS, BIOS, sorry and uh, it won't work since the driver is not signed and the next thing you should do is uh, to start this utility which you have probably previously downloaded if not you should download it then start it and let me just show you paste again this is a direct click open now if you're if you're using google chrome uh, there is a slight possibility that uh, 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 this file will be opened as text which you should do is click file and save as well this part anyway in Chrome and save as 7-zip password to all of my archives is 1234 as always and 
basically there are two files in here uh, let me minimize this one is the uh, patcher and the other one is system which you can actually also use to patch but uh, this one is actually not needed and basically after you click um, this thing yes you should just click patch yes and that is pretty much it uh, then you should reboot and everything should work just fine and you will probably get 29 mega hashes or something like that anyway so there you have it i hope you find this video useful and uh, yeah have a good day cheers